Hey Leo and welcome to your weekly love tarot readings. We are going to take a look at the messages that are coming in for you in relation to love and romance. These messages are general so please keep that in mind. If you are interested in a personalized tarot reading please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will provide you with my email address just below the video here and the show more section below. Okay so the reading here is intended for Leo Ascendant. Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising, and of course to those of you cross-watching as well. Okay, you have Strength here. The Lover's Card, the Empress, and the Queen of Pentacles. Wow! Bottom row, the King of Pentacles here, the Seven of Wands, the Two of Cups, and the Three of Pentacles. Okay. Um, wow, top row. Um, I'm just going to move them into frame a little bit. Okay, something here is going from strength to strength. An emotion, a feeling, momentum, um, a romantic connection here, a relationship here. Something here I feel like is getting stronger and stronger. Your feelings for someone, someone's feelings for you. A romantic connection is being solidified, is being cemented, is strengthening, is tightening. It's maybe you're becoming so much more closer. You're drawing so much, so much more closer to this person or to this thing here, to this end goal, to this ambition, to to this end point, to your point of attraction here. You're so close. You can almost feel it. I bet you. You're almost there. Whatever this is for you, for some of you, I do feel like maybe this is, you could find yourself falling in love with someone, or someone here is falling in love with you, um, they're in the process of falling in love with you, um, or you're getting, I don't know why Leo, but I feel like you're getting so much more closer to something or someone here. For some of you, maybe this is outside of romance. However, this is something you're truly passionate about. This is something you're truly aligned with. So it's like a dream, a goal, a desire, a point of attraction. A point of attraction that I feel like um, you're very enthusiastic about here. Okay, so something here, whether it's emotions for someone or something, this is getting stronger. This is getting bigger. Okay, it's becoming a lot more present, um, a lot more. It's becoming a lot more bigger here in your life as well. Um, it's growing. There's something here that's growing. For a lot of you, there are feelings here. Your feelings for someone are growing here. Allow them to happen. Allow it to happen naturally, fluidly, organically. Someone here may be falling in love with you. They're they're falling in love with the whole process of getting to know you, of building this connection, um, exploring this connection. Um, this is a beautiful energy here. Or you're falling in love with the process of meeting someone here, you know, building a connection with them. Or you're falling in love with the process of, you know, chasing your dream, your um, ambitions here. Whatever it is, nurture that energy, nurture those vibes, nurture that momentum, nurture those emotions, nurture that connection, whatever it is, nurture that feeling because that can only grow and intensify and um, this is amazing. Okay, um, the Knight of Pentacles here tells me that for some of you this you're waiting for something here or someone is waiting on you i feel like maybe they're waiting to receive an answer from you maybe they're waiting to um they're waiting to for you to respond here or maybe this is you you're waiting for it's like you're waiting to hear from someone or you're waiting for something to happen you're waiting for someone to make a move um the message that I'm getting, maybe it's time that you take the initiative here, pick up the phone and call them, or send a follow-up message here. Whatever it is that you're waiting for, I feel like take matters into your hands here this month, uh, and this week in particular. Because um, I feel like you're, you're close. I mean, you're close, you're in, you're in a great energy field here. I don't see what can go wrong, to be honest with you. So if there's something here you're waiting for, I do feel like you can speed things up by... Um, you know, taking on that initiative and just calling this person up or getting in contact with this person or following up with whoever this person is here. Okay, um, 
Leo, this is your energy, the Seven of Wands. That's a very strong energy here with the Seven of Wands, okay? Um, there's something here. You're offering up resistance towards something or someone. I don't know if it's someone, something someone says it gets you a little bit worked up here. I don't know if you're trying to resist or you're trying to fight something, if this is internal emotions or if this is external factors here. Um, whatever you're resisting here, be careful because it's persisting in some way, on some level here. Learn to deal with it, okay? Be okay with, make peace with the conflict, basically. Something here is coming together so beautifully for you. I don't know if you're, you know, if you're seeing evidence of this show up in your life just yet, or if you will see evidence, especially throughout this week, of this showing up in your life. You're coming into a romantic alignment with someone. Your relationship here is deepening, is strengthening. You're lining up with someone, or you're lining up with something, a dream, a goal, or a desire. For those of you that are single and looking for someone, you are so close to finding a soulmate here. You're so close to finding a soul partner, a twin flame, you're next here, you are, you're in alignment, you're there, okay, and you, the, your person is drawing closer to your energy field, you are so close here, Leo, so don't give up, do not despair, because I feel like right now, in this point in time, you are exactly where you need to be, even where you need to be isn't exactly where you want to be, or where you're, you know, you thought you would be, it's exactly where you need to be at this point in time so that it can get you to your next chapter, your next phase, your next level here, okay? Um, gosh, you're working on something here. Some of you, I feel like uh, you're working with someone. There's a lot of teamwork. Or it's like a pulled energy here this week. You can't do this on your own. So, you know, you're going to have to... You've got a lot of pride, Leo, but trust me, I feel like you will need someone's help here. So don't be afraid to reach out and ask, okay? Um, pick up the phone, ask for help. It's a, some sort of project for some of you. This is a career or a personal endeavor. For others of you, it's a relationship. If you're trying to make something work or whatever it is that you're trying to work on here, I feel like you can't do it on your own simply because it does require the efforts of someone else here because it's a pulling energy. They've got something to bring to the table here. So... You know, swallow your pride here if you have to, um, but I am seeing that you're going to have to collaborate with something because that's the only way this thing can get done because this thing right here is built on collaboration, it's built on team effort here, whatever this is for you here. So don't be afraid to ask for help or assistance because it will be readily available for you here. There are more, there are people around you who are more than willing to help. Um, Okay, and there we have it. So that is your week. Thank you guys for watching and listening. Please show your support by subscribing to this channel, liking, commenting, or sharing. If you are after a personal tarot reading, feel free to reach out. Otherwise, take care, guys. I'll catch up with you next week. Bye.